Hi everyone, this is Michelle from PhotoRx and I'm going to walk you through a few quick edits using Stockholm, our brand new Photoshop action set that mutes the tones and brightens the whites. You can get that Nordic and Scandinavian vibe in just a couple of clicks. For this image, I'm going to make sure I'm on my background and then scroll down to the filters. I'm going to go with the very first filter, muted tones and bright whites, and then press play. The dialog reminds me to be on my background layer, which I am, so I'll hit continue. And you can see those tones are muted and the whites are bright. Now just because this is crystals, I'm going to add a little pep. This is a tiny bit of contrast, so it makes it just look a little bit more crisp around the edges. For the next image, I want it to be just a little bit brighter. It's kind of dull. So I'm going to head to SO2, Muted Tones plus Light, and press play. Again, I'm on my background layer, so I'll hit continue. And you can see it might be a little bit too bright right up here where the paint meets the background, but that's okay because we can adjust the opacity. I can take it down however far I want to. Um, let's see here. I think that looks good. So you can see it mutes the tones on the bristles and brightens up the whites. For this next image, I want it to have a little more light as well, so I'm going to make sure I'm on my background, and then highlight SO2 muted tones plus light, and press play. I'll hit continue, and again, it's just a little bit too bright, so I'm going to bring it down. Now for the fun part. You can see how all the detail has been lost on this hat, but we can get some of that back by painting light on, right on the hat. So I'm going to highlight paint on lighter and press play. This dialog says to make sure we use a soft brush and to make sure our foreground color is white, which it is, so I will hit continue and select my brush. And then I'm just going to paint over the area where I want to add light. You can see it's bringing back a little detail over here on the corner of the hat. Um, it's not quite enough, but there's something we can do. We can duplicate this layer. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm just going to drag it down to this little new layer icon. And you can even do it again. And you can see it actually brings back more of that detail. So that's it. That's all there is to it. We hope you guys will have so much fun. And as always, we love to see your work. Tag us on Instagram at PhotoRxCo. We can't wait to see.